Hey, what's up everyone? You're here with Gordon from Pink Dogs, and you're here for your free picks from German Bundesliga on Saturday, March 11th. Uh, five great games on the schedule in Bundesliga, guys, and uh, we are gonna kick it off uh, at 9.30 a.m. Eastern with a few games. Uh, Bayern is playing, Eintracht Frankfurt is playing, and uh, Leipzig and Borussia Mönchengladbach uh, are that... Uh, very big derby game uh, at 9.30 a.m. And we are going to close Bundesliga with a, a classic matchup, a Riviera derby between Schalke and Borussia Dortmund at 12.30 p.m. Eastern. If you want more free picks from different leagues, of course, uh, go to the Pink Dogs YouTube channel and check those out as well. We have uh, free picks from every... Uh, every one of the top five european football leagues so that's uh, league one Serie A, bundesliga epl and la liga as well uh so check it out guys uh, and of course subscribe and hit that like button uh eintracht is hosting stuttgart and uh, that should be a very interesting game because uh, we have two struggling teams uh, stuttgart is playing better over the last few weeks and uh, they were able to score goals pretty consistently over the last uh last four games they played against and uh, they were even pretty solid against Bayern last week however they ended up losing that game 2-1 and before that they lost to Schalke 2-1 now even though they are playing a little bit better over the last few weeks they're still not winning points consistently and they're still struggling to win games uh, which is actually uh, putting them in the relegation battle and uh, they are now in 16th place with only 19 points as far as Eintracht goes, they have cooled off a lot uh, and uh, they haven't won any of their last three games. Uh, they have dropped out of the Champions League zone in Bundesliga. They are now in sixth place. And uh, on top of that, they have a very, very big game against Napoli in the Champions League next week. Uh, which leads me to think that uh, Frankfurt will pretty much rest uh, at least three or four of their starters uh, in, in this game just for them to be ready for that game against Napoli because 2-0 uh, is not that uh, big of a result that you cannot chase it and uh, get close to Napoli and as, we, as we've as we seen throughout the season Eintracht definitely has the quality to compete with the big dogs. Uh, in this game I, I expect a fairly open matchup with a lot of chances on both sides. Both teams will definitely try to get a win here to snap the losing streaks they are on and even though Stuttgart is still without a single win on the road this season, I feel like they will step up this game, uh, step up in this game a little bit more. And uh, I feel like uh, they are starting to feel the pressure of that uh, of that relegation zone, and uh, they need to get some points as, as as soon as possible. So for that reason, guys, I'm gonna take Stuttgart on the double chess here at uh, at plus 100. I think it's definitely worth a shot. And uh, the fact that Eintracht is playing in the Champions League next week definitely made this, de this decision a lot easier for me because, like I said, I think that they will be arresting some players in this game. So I'm taking Stuttgart on the double chance. Bayern Munich is hosting Augsburg in this matchup and uh, they are huge, huge favorites. As we can see, the price is no longer minus 770, it's minus 1000 right now. Uh, they're coming off of a fantastic win against PSG. They definitely put them to shame. Uh, they outplayed them in every aspect of the game. Defensively very solid. Uh, created a lot of chances, especially in the second half. Scored two goals and uh, knocked PSG out of the Champions League. Bayern Munich has won five of their last six games. They are now on a three-game winning streak. And they're still undefeated at home this season. And if they really need an incentive to play this game at their best. Uh, they just have to take a look at the standings and see that Borussia Dortmund has the same amount of points as they do and that potentially if they drop points here, Borussia Dortmund will take over the top of the table. Uh, finally, we have ourselves a very interesting and very fun competition, Bundesliga and uh, Bayern is feeling the pressure a little bit. However, they are still the team to beat and... Uh, I think that they will get another win here because Augsburg on the road is pretty bad team. Uh, they have only three wins, uh, one draw and seven losses. They're not scoring a lot of goals on the road and they're facing the best home team in the league. So I think that Bayern will come out flying in this one. I think they will start fast and for that reason I'm going to take Bayern minus 1.5 Asian line in the first half. 
that's plus 145. I think in the 20th minute, we're going to see at least 2 nil for Bayern Munich and uh, possibly even third and fourth goal in the first half alone. So Bayern minus 1.5 in the first half at plus 125. Hertha Berlin is hosting Mainz in this uh, in this matchup where they will try to get another win or at least a draw to uh, stay out of the out of the relegation zone to keep that 15th place and uh, to give themselves a little bit more breathing room. However, they are now facing this very strong Mainz team, the team that's on a four-game winning streak, the team that kept uh, two clean sheets in a row, and the team that has been quite effective in that attack again as of late. Uh, if Mainz was uh, in just a little bit weaker form, if they haven't won four of their last four games, if they were not on this big winning streak they are on, I would give Hertha a little bit of a chance here. But uh, Hertha has been very inconsistent this season, and plus 150 on a team that's on a four-game winning streak, yeah, I'll take it. Even though it's on the road, I'll take Mainz on the body line here. Plus 150. They are healthy, they have a couple of injured players, which they had for a while, and uh, they have a lot of depth, they have more quality than Hertha does, and like I said, even though they are playing on the road, I'm taking bites on the money line at plus 150. Uh, Leipzig and against Borussia Mönchengladbach, this is the game I mentioned uh, at the start of the video, and uh, I don't even know what to think about this Borussia Mönchengladbach team anymore. Uh, they go on to beat Bayern Munich 3-2, uh, then they lost to Mainz 4-0, uh, they almost lost to Freiburg, that game ended in a 0-0 draw, but they conceded a red card at the end of the game and uh, it almost cost them, and because of that red card, they will be without Ben, without ben Sebaidi in this game, uh, Julian Weigel is still injured, and uh, uh, Jonas Oblit is injured as well, who is their goalkeeper. Uh, which means that uh, probably the, the I don't know third string goalkeeper will be uh, will be in the lineup here uh, for for Borussia Mönchengladbach, and uh, I think that Leipzig will know how to take advantage of that because they are a very very experienced team, the team with a lot of offense, and even though Nkuku is listed as injured here, uh, I think he might get the last 15 20 minutes or so just to keep him as healthy as possible for that Champions League matchup that Leipzig has next week against uh, Manchester City. Uh, in the head-to-head -head games, uh, in the last three matches when Leipzig was the home team here, we saw uh, both teams to score an over 2.5 hit. In this matchup alone, the over 2.5 has been hitting more often than it hasn't, and uh, I think that uh, if I had to choose a side, it would be Leipzig here because Borussia has been very inconsistent this season. They have won only one game on the road and uh, Leipzig at home has lost only once this season. So, like I said, they definitely deserve to be the favorites they are, but I'm going to stay away from sides and I'm going to take both teams to score at over 2.5, minus 105. This has been on the money in this matchup and uh, I think it's going to be the same in this game as well. And we are closing the Bundesliga day with this uh, Riviera derby, like I said, guys, between Schalke and Borussia Dortmund. Uh, one of the biggest derbies in Germany. And uh, for once, we have these two teams playing in excellent form. And even Schalke uh, is actually undefeated in their last six games in a row. And they have given themselves hope that they can stay in, in Bundesliga for at least another season. Uh, at the moment, uh, Schalke is at the bottom of the table, but with a positive result out of this game, they actually have a chance of getting out of the relegation zone, and if they win this game, they will definitely get out of the relegation zone, which would be something that uh, they haven't experienced since the season started. Borussia Dortmund on the other side is coming off of a very bad performance against Chelsea in the Champions League. But they are tied with Bayern at the top of the table with 49 points and now they have to stay consistent. Now they don't have to worry about the Champions League anymore. Uh, they can go all out in, in Bundesliga and potentially take the title away from Bayern. And that's something I would definitely like to see because Bayern has won the last 12 titles in Bundesliga if I'm not mistaken and uh, they are still the team to beat. But uh, Borussia Dortmund for once looks like a championship team and uh, the team that could definitely win the title. I just hope that they can stay consistent because that has been their problem over the 
last five or six years when they get close to Bayern Munich they choke and uh, they drop points where they shouldn't uh, and uh, that has caused them in the past but uh, we'll see if they can bounce back after that Champions League loss here uh, they're minus 139 favorites and uh, that's the price I will take uh, I'll take Borussia Dortmund on the money line I'm not willing to take this game to go over 2.5 simply because Schalke has been stepping up their defense and Borussia has been a bit ineffective in that attack again. But then again, minus 132 on Borussia Dortmund on the money line. That's a price we just cannot miss. That's it guys. Thank you for joining me here. These were free picks from Bundesliga on Saturday. For my best bets, go to the Pink Dogs website. Go to that previous section and see what I have up there. And of course, if you want more free picks, uh, go to the Pick Dogs YouTube channel and check those out as well. Uh, enjoy your Saturday, guys. Uh, spend it with your family, play some bets, and uh, let's win some money together, guys.